What's going on YouTube? Uberman here. Big, big news for Lyft. Lyft's first international city will be Toronto, Canada. So congratulations to Lyft and all of the Lyft supporters out there for finally breaking through those international borders and becoming an international company. That's big, big news. So I'm going to read a small portion of this article for you guys. Uh, link will be in the description if you want to read it for yourself. This is from Recode. And it says, Lyft, the $11 billion Uber rival is beginning its international expansion. The company announced it would be launching in Toronto, Canada by the end of this year. That's 2017. The company, which is in the middle of closing a $1 billion round from Alphabet, has been in hyper growth mode this year, launching in at least 100 additional cities across the U.S. over the last few months. Now Lyft is giving Uber a run for its money. New CEO Dara said Uber won't be profitable in the U.S. for at least the next six months because of what Lyft was spending on growth. Wow. It depends on where the company goes, Dara said at the New York Times Deal Book Conference last week. Right now, we have a situation where Lyft is spending very aggressively to gain share. This year, Lyft ate into Uber's market share nationally, causing the ride hail behemoth's hold on the U.S. to fall from 84% to 73 that is, that is more than a 10% gain in market share. And let me tell you something, going up against Uber, that's a big deal. And Uber is probably working on some kind of a solution to this problem, if there even is one. Now, personally, I'm not picking sides. I'm happy for Lyft. I'm happy for Uber. I am just happy to be right where I am in the middle of all of this, because I'm in a great position to sit back and watch and basically see where the cards fall. Um, so Lyft, congratulations to you and all you Lyft fans out there. Absolutely. I'm, you know, part of the Lyft family now. So it's exciting for me as well to sit back and watch them expand past the United States. And, you know, let's see what happens next. Next year, I think, is going to be very, very impressive as far as ride sharing goes. I think we're going to see a lot of changes next year. I'm really excited for 2018. Thanks for watching this video. As always, like, comment, subscribe. Most importantly, stay safe out there. Uber and Lyft on.